you know i understand that you are tired to be being stuck in a dead end job right many times we join certain kind of a jobs which i think are mostly into a dead end we have some passion for the technology but we are into a non it background right we want to move to an it but how do i do it which topics i have to learn which uh, roadmap i have to learn right these kind of question generally i get a lot in this video we are going to discuss about easiest way to move from non it or slash freshers to a qa role specifically qa role because i am into qa industry for almost 11 years i have seen multiple multiple students who have switched from non it to it right even i have switched right i was from electronics and communication background so i have switched to qa role right almost like as did manager i am working with right so how i have done it in this video i'm going to discuss about it so let's get started first of all why especially the software testing i think it is one of the fastest growing demanding career right now suppose consider this scenario every company whenever they have developers because software testing is a part of it right so they will have certain kind of software testers most of the product based companies as well as multinational mnc's right you have seen service based company they have software testers either in the form of manuals or automation that's a different thing but they have a software tester because software testing is a part of it, it basically also open ups for a new roles which means i have seen uh, one of my student right who was a no it background he was from i think he was a waiter right he basically switched to manual after like 3 or 5 years then it basically opened up a new career i have seen people uh, switching from manual to development devops roles and multiple roles so if you want to open up a new opportunity spectrum right i think software testing is the easiest way or a qa role is the easiest way where you can start opportunities are there and i think it's a demanding skill i know people are saying software testing is dead 2030 there will be no software testing job see these are again no one can say right which job will exist in 2030 or something like this right now what is working think about only 3 years or 4 years what exactly it is working and let's proceed with it. even when i have started i have no idea if i will become an automation tester after some time i started as a manual tester then become an automation tester then become a lead qa manager and other things so don't think too much about those things but think about like 3 year or 5 years that's the simple important things let's discuss the most important thing which is skills good news is that you don't need formal it background or anything right to become a qa role or software testing i have seen people switching from bsc bcom background to qa role because i have seen people i have worked with those people who are from a bcom background and they are working as a manual or a automation tester also even in end i have seen that so that's what i am talking about from a confidence that yes no it background can switch to qa role I have seen that we have also hired multiple people who are are not from an IT background but some companies have a strict policies that they want only IT background people but many companies they don't have so yes you should be aware about the problem solving abilities i think this is super important and strong understanding of fundamentals of testing if you are a fresher or a non IT background right you have a career gap you want to switch to qa right i think easiest way is have a road map road map i have already created for you you should know the topics so topics problem i have sorted out a road map i have sorted out third thing is accelerate how do you accelerate this thing right uh, promote i want to learn about the concept within like 3 months or 4 months because i have to switch my job then the easiest way will be joining some kind of internship or you can say joining some kind of a training program also for example right now if you see manual testing course that we are going to launch right so i am launching a manual testing batch of february right we have done two three batches last time amazing results people got some amazing amazing opportunities some people got double jobs right also so yeah those videos are also coming in but again so if you want to join sd.live/manual you can join that right there is a libel discount going on you can be a part of that uh, course group where we cover manual testing in depth with live projects i love live projects i do e-commerce sales related projects are there or uh, crm related projects are there right plus i have included api testing also where api testing now now is mandatory for all of us to learn even as a fresher as well as uh, from non it background right so you have to learn so api testing manually like for by using postman we have basically added sql also i have added because you basics of sql as a thing you should know to get started these are like fundamental and these are like pillars core pillars of a software qa if you are well versed of these things definitely you will be able to crack any kind of interview so resume preparation interview preparations those things are also part of that course you can check it out link is in the description which is sd.live/manual now let's get started ramo how do i get started easiest way again i told you take a mentor i can be your mentor also courses youtube there are more lots of videos free available you can watch them but again though those are not very structured if you want to accelerate i think easiest way will be mentor with the courses always latest technologies and trends right please be aware about it new tools are coming new new things are coming right make sure you are aware about now the super important last but it is super super important is networking guys network with the people network with lots of people with your peer whoever is working into the it field right network with them. let me tell you very important point i got a job from a product based company because i networked with one of the librarian can you imagine that librarian basically referred me to a product based company so network 
networking is super important from what exactly networking networking means meet people who are even are not from your background help them what they are doing right right are they working in any it field or anything right ask them have a relationship with them right you can have a chat something like this right after that you can ask them a favor right do you have any opening or i can see there is some opening in your company or in some other company can you help me so generally whenever you ask for help nobody will say no generally people don't say no so you can ask them that's how i got my product based company you can you imagine a librarian help me to get a product based company as a qr so that's what i have seen so network with the people attend online conferences or any conference that you want related to software testing right there you will find like minded people who will help you to get a job into a qa so that's how the easiest way to jump into the qa in conclusion let me reiterate software testing is one of the easiest role to switch to from a non it background i think that i've seen it skills you needed of course problem solving and a proper training of a manual plus api i think this is super super important topic and road map i have already shared in the comments it's a full road map containing all the topics and in like two and half half months how you can become a mentor tester these are things are included uh, if you want to accelerate easiest way is to have a mentor or a course you can join them a community and network with the people that's the super important thing and that's the only way there is no other way where you can basically move from non it to especially to a qa role all right i hope this makes sense i hope this video was helpful uh, just type in the comment helpful if this was helpful if you want to join the course as the dot live slash manual i'll see you in the live classes thanks a lot for joining if you are existing subscriber thanks a lot for joining and if you are new i create videos around the software testing test automation and productivity related uh, consider subscribing thanks a lot i'll see you in the next video